Each year, ASCE and SEI honor members who make significant contributions to the structural engineering profession through publishing outstanding papers, dedication to technical excellence, and by providing exemplary service and leadership to ASCE and SEI. ASCE Awards for Achievement in Structural Engineering. The Short Ridge Hardesty Award is given to an individual who has applied fundamental results of research to practical engineering problems in structural stability. And the 2020 award goes to Ben Young for contributing substantially to the application of fundamental results of research to solving practical structural stability problems in cold formed and stainless steel structures. He has contributed significantly to the developments of design provisions in both the North American specification and the ASCE specification for the design of cold-formed steel structural members. The Jack E. Cermak Medal is awarded for outstanding contributions to research and or practice in wind engineering. And the 2020 award goes to Peter Vickery for his contributions in the development of hurricane hazard models for risk analysis and for his major impact on the development of building codes and standards in North America. He has led the team at Applied Research Associates Incorporated that has provided the wind speed contours in the ASCE 7 standard along the hurricane coastlines of the USA since 2005. He has been a longtime member of the Wind Committee of ASCE 7, where his broad knowledge of wind engineering, combined with his expertise in probability and structural reliability, has been invaluable in the development of improved provisions for wind loading. The Moiseev Award honors an ASCE journal paper that makes a significant contribution in structural design. And the 2020 award goes to Skasa Mizutani, Tomonori Nagayama, Tomwaki Takeda, and Yozo Fujino for their paper, Reproduction of Cable Stayed Bridge Seismic Responses Involving Tower Girder Pounding and Damage Process Estimation for Large Earthquakes, because of its strong reviewer recommendations and novelty of the work. The Nathan M. Newmark Medal is an award from the Engineering Mechanics Institute and SEI of ASE to honor its namesake for his outstanding contributions in structural engineering and mechanics. And the 2020 award goes to Satish Nagarahaya for the development of nonlinear dynamic analysis techniques for base isolated structures, development of adaptive stiffness systems, negative stiffness systems, smart tuned mass dampers, for sparse structural system identification techniques and laser-based non-contact strain sensing using nanomaterials. The Raymond C. Reese Research Prize honors a journal paper that makes an outstanding contribution to the application of structural engineering research. And the 2020 award goes to Dan Mircha Frangapol and Jan Liu for their paper, Utility and Information Analysis for Optimum Inspection of Fatigue-Sensitive Structures. This paper makes a significant contribution to the design of an optimum decision-making framework that schedules future structural inspections on the basis of achieving maximum information utility to decision-makers. The Jack E. Cermak Medal is awarded for outstanding contributions to research and or practice in wind engineering. And the 2019 award goes to Kenny Kwok for making a continuous contribution over the last 40 years to the study and practice of wind engineering, primarily in the fields of wind-induced structural dynamics, vibration control, full-scale measurements of building responses and occupant response to building motion. His innovative work using building motion simulators to understand the psychological and neurophysiological response of building occupants is a perfect example of the cross-disciplinary, out-of-the-box thinking that has allowed him to innovate for such an extended period of time. The Richard R. Torrens Award honors a volunteer journal editor who makes outstanding contributions to the ASCE Publications Program. And the 2019 award goes to Anil Agrawal 
He is currently a Herbert G. Kaiser Professor of Structural Bridge Engineering at the City College of New York and the Chief Editor of the ASCE Journal of Bridge Engineering. He has been the past Chair of ASCE Committees on Structural Control and Sensing and Bridge Inspection, Rehabilitation and Monitoring. In 2015, he received the President's Award for Excellence in Scholarship, Teaching and Service at the City College of New York. Dr. Agrawal has published more than 250 articles, including more than 100 peer-reviewed journal articles and more than 20 reports. Congratulations and thank you to all the ASCE Structural Award winners. The Structural Engineering Institute Awards recognize those whose contributions have helped advance the goals of the Institute. The SEI Graduate Student Chapter of the Year Award recognizes exemplary efforts to advance and serve the structural engineering profession. And the 2020 award goes to the SEI Graduate Student Chapter at Northeastern University, Massachusetts. Its officers and members are commended for their dedication in creating activities, such as the seminar series and documentary night, to keep members engaged and active. This group has displayed an excellent mix of technical and social activities that relate well to the students and help them transition into the workforce, including a full website developed to promote the chapter. The SEI Chapter of the Year Award recognizes outstanding achievement by local SEI professional chapters to advance and serve structural engineering. And the 2020 award goes to the SEI Houston Chapter for their efforts in advancing the structural engineering profession by staying active and engaging their members. Their 11 technical sessions that included well-diverse structural engineering topics to bring different backgrounds within the community are notable. Having practical industrial technical sessions not only improved the structural engineering community technical knowledge, but also brought their community together for the opportunity to network. The W. Jean Corley Award is awarded to an individual for their work to advance and distinguish structural engineering as a profession, including licensure for structural engineers. And the 2020 award goes to Randall P. Bernhardt for being a tireless advocate for structural engineering licensure. As chair of the Structural Engineering Institute Professional Activities Committee and now chair of the Structural Engineering Licensure Coalition, he has spearheaded the effort to create a national consensus document that defines significant structures, the type or class of structures that should be designed by licensed structural engineers. The Walter P. Moore Jr. Award recognizes a structural engineer who has demonstrated technical expertise in and dedication to the development of structural codes and standards. And the 2020 award goes to Charles A. Kircher for his more than three decades of involvement and leadership in the development of seismic design requirements incorporated in ASCE SEI 7 and the NEHRP provisions, seismic-related guidelines produced by FEMA and ATC methods to estimate earthquake losses incorporated in the Hazus Loss Estimation Technology and Software, and design requirements for seismic isolation technologies incorporated in ASCE 7 and the NEHRP provisions. He has been a key member of the ASCE SEI 7 Seismic Subcommittee Task Committee since 2000 and has provided important contributions in the areas of seismic design ground motions and requirements for structures utilizing seismic isolation and damping systems. The Dennis L. Tewksbury Award honors its namesake, the first president of SEI, and recognizes an SEI member who has promoted the growth and visibility of SEI, established working relationships between SEI and other structural engineering organizations, and has rendered valuable service to the engineering profession. And the 2020 award goes to Donald Dusenberry for advancing the interests of SEI through impactful leadership, promoting the growth and visibility of SEI, establishing working relationships between SEI and other structural engineering organizations, advocating for structural engineering licensure, SEI global expansion, 
and performance-based design, and he has deeply impacted the structural engineering profession. The SEI President's Award recognizes an SEI member who has made exemplary contributions to the success of the Institute. And the 2020 award goes to David Koch for advancing the future vision of structural engineers and structural engineering. In his terms on the SEI board and as SEI president, David worked tirelessly to update SEI's vision document, foster a collaborative relationship amongst SEI, NCSEA, and CASE, and create a joint vision and implementation plan that is being pursued by the three organizations.